What's up guys, so we're at DSTV Premiership Action. It was uh, Mazulu going up against Orlando Pirates in the game ending 1-1. Another draw for these teams. I think Mazulu have about 10 draws and I think Orlando Pirates have uh, 7 draws as well this season. I mean, if you're going to try to dislodge uh, Mamlodi Sundowns, if you're going to try to challenge Mamlodi Sundowns, you have to win games, guys. You have to win games. You can't be drawing games, you know, and... And they've just had too many draws this season. But if you look at the game, if we're specifically focusing on the 90 minutes that played, I thought the game had intensity. I thought the game had commitment. I thought the game had determination from the players, commitment as well from the players as well. But also it was just too quick. It was too fast. And too fast in a sense that none of the teams had long possessions of, of control in the game or long times of, or long periods of control in the game. I think there were spurts that... Um, Zulu had their chances and then they were controlling the games and I think also Orlando Pirates had spurts where they were controlling the game and having having their having their opportunities as well. But I would say I think Orlando Pirates had more of the spurts than what Amazulu did have. I think in the first half when you saw Amazulu was the key players was very was very quick to spot in, in the sense that Mamela was a key player, Moremi was quick was a key player as well. And I think De Jong as well, he was sort of the target man having to play off them. Or at least get the ball and having to give them the ball as well. Get the ball, give them the ball. I thought that with Orlando Pirates, on the other hand, I only could see that their threat was John Hotto. I didn't think anyone else was going to score, in which he did get the goal. But uh, I didn't see Kwame Pepra scoring as well. He did test Velimoto, but I didn't see too many threats from the Orlando Pirates side. I think as the game goes on, it was too much of a basketball game. It was just too fast. Like none of the teams were just really having long positions of the ball, I guess, or long control of the, of, of, of the game as well. I think the quality of subs that Orlando Pirates brought on were much better than Amazulu. And I think it showed because Amazulu was starting to tire out and the likes of Lodge having to come on, it kept Orlando Pirates' tempo up it kept their pressure keep, kept on going and I think they still couldn't make the breakthrough I think Makaula was a huge miss for Mazulu that control in the midfield that he could have but again I don't think a draw benefits either team